Hi, everyone. I'm Linda Lasanti, Editor-in-Chief of Convenience Store News, and this is our Weekend Digest for Sunday, October 23rd. Each week, we round up the biggest headlines in the convenience store industry for you. In the news this week, grocery retailers Albertsons and Kroger announced a merger agreement. Kroger will acquire all outstanding shares of Albertsons for a total enterprise value of approximately $24.6 billion. The combination will establish a national footprint across 48 states and Washington, D.C. And post-merger, the combined companies will operate nearly 5,000 stores and more than 2,000 gas stations. Take a look at our story for more on this merger agreement. Convenience Store News this week also reported on how convenience store retailers are diversifying their businesses. Quick Trip and its wholly owned subsidiary, Medwise LLC, plan to open more walk-in medical clinics in regions such as Wichita, Kansas, and Kansas City, Missouri. There are currently 11 Medwise urgent care clinics in operation. And Circle K stores are going to be part of a medical cannabis pilot in Florida. Through a lease agreement with Circle K, Green Thumb Industries plans to roll out approximately 10 Rise Express branded dispensaries adjacent to Circle K stores. The rollout will start next year. You can check out our stories for more information on these innovative initiatives. And on the What to Watch forefront, the National Retail Federation's latest monthly economic review highlighted that despite inflation and interest rate hikes, consumers are still spending on household priorities. However, shoppers are looking for bargains and value in the current economic environment, and this is only expected to increase as we head into the holiday season. Check out our website, csnews.com, for more on this report and additional consumer insights. There's much more in our Weekend Digest newsletter and on our website. So happy reading, everyone, and have a great day.